Rage on that beat, going crazy. Hello there, I'm Ananya and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Let's draw something today, shall we? So the idea behind this video is how much have I improved in realistic portrait sketching in 3 years? Let's find out. So, this was my very first attempt in realistic portrait art back in 2018. As you may recognize her, she is Christine aka Simply Neological. Or maybe not because I drew her so bad. And a lot of people had a few words to speak about the disproportionate mouth. I mean, come on. It's my first try. Don't roast me. She is my favorite YouTuber ever and she had also liked this one. So yay. Wow, I had a weird Insta ID back then. Next up, 2019. Also, if you are confused, um, yep. I drew only one portrait in 2018 and this one in 2019 and I'm going to draw another one right now for this year. So it's not like, oh my god, three years, hard work, improvement. It's more like I'm lazy. <laughs> wow, this video is not what most people expected it to be. I'm sorry guys. By the way, this is Gudu Dan Dhawa, one of my favorite singers. You must have this idea by now that I only draw my favorite people. Okay, we can see a little improvement on the second time. Only the face seems a little distorted, but that's because of his standing pose. That's my excuse. I remember losing my patience while drawing both of these and rushing by the end to finish it in one day, but not this time. I'm going to patiently draw and see how realistic I can get on my third try today on doing a portrait. So today I'll be drawing another favorite person of mine, my favorite photographer, Brandon Warford. I mean, look at this guy's feet, come on. I always keep his pictures in my WhatsApp DP, wallpaper, so talented, love his style, forever a fan. Just a little nervous because this picture that I have picked seems really hard to draw. I mean, the hair, the hands, the DSLR? I'm scared. Okay, let's just begin. So I have my drawing paper here clipped on a board. I have these three pencils. Two wooden, one mechanical. By the way, I have no idea about drawing pencils. These were just lying around and this mechanical one seemed to be darker than the others, so yeah. I'm going to start off by putting margins, which I clearly did not do in the previous ones. First, I'm trying to add a few points and lines for guiding me through. Nearly all artists are like sketch, 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 outline, boom. They'll make like crosses, heads and stuff, but I don't know how to do that and that's exactly why it takes so long. I'm going to start drawing from the center. I'm glad that I don't have to draw any detailed eyeballs today because more details equals more chances for me to mess up. Wow, could we just take a while to appreciate how seamlessly this pencil works? It blends so good. It is also so dark. Good job, Holix. I want to nail each and every detail, each and every little fold, spot, everything. I just want to take my time and make it as realistic as I possibly can. Don't want to rush this time. I'm going to bring down the exposure so that you can clearly see what's going on. Um, this light blue one doesn't really work that well for me. Yeah, this works better. I mean, it's okay, but it doesn't blend that nicely. Mr. Light Blue, what's happening? You can leave. <laughs> Holix, save the day. The mouth. I remember while doing Christine's portrait, I was just erasing and redoing her mouth a hundred times. Even then, I didn't get it right. Careful, Ananya.
Does it look like Brandon yet? Okay, now time for another scary part. The hand. If I mess up even a little bit here, the fingers are gonna look like they're crooked and broken. Okay, the hand is done. Yay! I did it. There's a cute little smiley face. Aww. Here I'm trying to get the texture of the fabric right. You can't really see the bottom part because of my setup. Okay, let me try to do something here. Um, now for the nightmare. Let's just do it. Okay, no, something is wrong here according to my calculations. Redo. 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 Oh, okay, we'll do that later. Let's do the hair. That hair looks so good! Brandon Waffle, welcome to my hair salon. I'll make your hair go wild, only if you could take my pictures for my Instagram. Oh yeah! Okay, time for the DSLR. The lens. There's some beautiful bokeh action going on. I love bokeh, but I don't think I can replicate that. Now for another hand. We can do it guys! Okay. 
okay that does not look right so i don't know how to fix that let it be like that maybe i got a little extra paper on the side so i'm going to put another margin and trim the extra paper off okay you know what i think i figured the hand thing out let's try again okay looks good by the way this is the tombow brush pen the soft tip one And we are done. Roll the B-roll, please. It's not a game. It's a red that turned out good. Good job. To me and no i'm not going to put the reference picture in the side because i know that will make my thing look bad okay there we go yes mine looks bad now okay let's compare the first one here i was more worried to make it actually look like christine and did not really care to add the teeny tiny details i just did the basic thing like the hair i did not even try nope Oh, the kitty cat headband looks kind of cute. At least I got her contour right, so I'm so sorry, Christine. I can recreate this one. If you guys would like me to do so, you can comment below and let me know. Wow, the cloth is full of eraser dust right now. Here's my second attempt. As you can see, a little improvement as I said before. I remember being so exhausted by the end of this that I did not even care to make the coat look good. The coat and the hair looks absolutely horrible and then 2020 my third attempt i love it even if it's not the exact same thing as my reference i still love it also this time i tried to put the absolute tiniest details like the hair the coat the face everything also the main reason of this looking good is because i did not put a time limit the first one and the second one i finished those in one day Maybe it took me like 8 hours, but this one, ladies and gentlemen, took me nearly 17 hours in the span of 4 days. That means nearly double the time. Yes, I'm that slow, but maybe if I do more than one portrait a year, I may improve. There's still hope for me. So yeah, that was it. Subscribe for more content like this and some other stuff from me. Ring the bell to never miss an upload. Comment below what you want to see next and I'll see you guys soon. Stay safe and wash your hands. Bye.